This is a WISN 12 editorial with President and General Manager Jan Wade. The state of Wisconsin just earned a new distinction, but it's not one to be proud of. 24-7 Wall Street named us the second drunkest state in the country. The ranking, based on data from the CDC, tracks the highest levels of adults who binge drink or drink heavily. 24.5% of Wisconsin adults report binge or heavy drinking, well above the 18% national level. If that's not bad enough, we also have 12 of the top 20 drunkest cities. While excessive drinking doesn't always lead to adverse outcomes, the state of Wisconsin also ranks as the eighth highest in alcohol-related driving deaths. Some claim that drinking is part of Wisconsin's culture, so much so that drinking and driving is tolerated here more than most other places. We have a powerful tavern league strong on anti-OWI legislation. So powerful, in fact, that just last year, we finally passed a law making a fourth OWI offense a felony and stiffened penalties for a fifth through tenth offense. Fifth through tenth, really? Most states make the first offense a crime and use ignition interlocks, car breathalyzers, and jail to deter offenders. They've had great success, but not Wisconsin. Some think we need to change the drinking culture. I think we need to change the laws, because changing the laws will change the culture. I'm Jan Wade.